Hey guys, good morning. I woke up and I literally like was like shocked because it is 9:50 a.m. I haven't slept in for about three weeks, but I finally had a morning where I could sleep in a little bit more. I've been waking up at like 5 or 6 a.m. for most of my classes, but I'm currently in final season, so we do have certain like break days. Thank you so much to Bed Bath and Beyond for partnering with me on this video. Okay, time to get dressed for the day. Okay, here's the fit. Purple shirt with like... And then here are just some black shorts. I know the outfit is not much, but please understand that I'm not in official summer mode yet, so I can't try and like wear summery clothes because I feel like a lot of summer fashion is not that comfortable. Mm, oops. I don't know. It just really isn't. And so I've just been wearing like this type of vibe because Hawaii got so hot already. After school ends, I will strive to, you know, put, put some cuter like summer clothes together. All right, so things I need to do today are to clean up my room a little bit because as you can see, it's getting a little bit messy. And I feel like when the space around me is neater than my thoughts are my focus, if that makes sense. I just got this new section in my room. Look at how cute it is. It's such a pretty pink carpet. And then I have this little table on it and it's just perfect. Demonstration. This is good for studying so I can like work here and then my, if I have friends over they can hang out here So I just put the camera on the table and this would be such a cute new place to start filming videos And the height of it is perfect especially when I'm studying or doing things for long periods of time I like to like move around so I obviously have my area right there And then sometimes I move to the bed, but then now I have this space which is really nice too So I just want to show you guys my new space because I'm so excited about it literally everyone in my life has been talking about my uncle from China got this vacuum and he's like it's amazing I was telling my mom to get it and then I was on the Bed Bath & Beyond site looking for some new stuff for my room try this so I was like okay we are gonna try this new vacuum it's cordless which sounds amazing because right now I never vacuum my room just because it's too much of a hassle and we store our vacuum because it's super bulky downstairs in the garage so I'm just way too lazy to go you know, we never do that. I'm gonna show you guys now how I make my iconic breakfast. <laughs> have my beautiful storage of my babies. These are the pods that I'm gonna put into the coffee machine. Guys, one just like fell in there because I forgot to lock it well. Ah! Okay, let's try this again. Lock it. Okay, and it just starts going. Okay, so on this level, it gives you like a little bit of coffee, which is what you can see. So it's like a shot. And then I'm gonna do the lower one now so that it can make a bigger cup. Oh, okay, so something spilled in the fridge. I think it's heavy cream, but I'm trying to wipe it up now. That's nasty. It's like clotted. Oh my goodness. Ooh, fridge lighting. The coffee tastes so good. Okay, so all I added was coffee with ice, added a little bit of syrup, and then whatever milk you like, and then creamer if you like that too. It's so good. It literally tastes just like Starbucks. I'm saving so much money now that I have the Nespresso. Okay, we have the coffee all made, and now I'm gonna be making pesto toast with an egg on top, which is what I make literally every single day if you follow me on my Instagram. I have my cute little pot on the stove. Thanks, mommy. You're welcome. <laughs> We're just gonna cover it up and let it steam a little bit. It is the most perfect cute little pot from this pans and pot set that I just got from Bed and Bath because a lot of ours were getting like dinged up and we always bought that brand so we just needed a refresh. Okay, I've also seen on TikTok where people are making pesto egg toast sort of thing except they put the pesto on the bottom of the pan and then just cook the eggs in it but then I just personally put my pesto on the toast because I'm worried that I will burn my pesto or something like that so I just haven't tried that trend yet but if you have, let me know how it is. Sometimes it gets kind of explosive, but here's what it should look like. It looks ready now. As you can see, it's kind of jiggly still with the yolk. Here are all the seasonings that I use. I don't know 
why my egg looks so weird today, but you know, it has a little bit of a jiggle to it, which is good. Here's my iconic pesto egg toast. So while I eat my breakfast, I'm gonna be editing a TikTok just because I'm trying to get more into TikTok and showing more of my life on there because it's so much easier in a way than vlogging for YouTube because you have to like edit so much. Anyways, now I'm gonna go pick up Ethan because he's gonna come help me like film some stuff today. I do prefer coexisting with others. Anyways, okay, I'll see you guys when he's here. Ethan's here now. He say hi to my friends. This is Lammy, Ethan's toy from 21 years ago. And these are the rest of our friends. Oh, okay, Ethan just showed me that it's supposed to be like this actually. Pull it up. So, Nespresso's been making coffee for like a really long it makes like very fancy like coffee machines and they actually used to be like 600 to a grand just like for a, like a small nice one mm -hmm. but now like they've made it more commercialized i guess okay, so i'm gonna get ready a little bit by straightening my hair i've just been busy all day so i didn't do it yet but i have this really awesome hair straightener it's the conair to it one so you can also curl it using this if you see it's like round or you can just straighten it and it's been helping because my hair is so dead that like it's always like frizzy if you see it like fluffy hair now but this baby whips it into shape and it literally holds for a full week i want to do some makeup because we're gonna film some tiktoks of like unboxing stuff today probably and then ethan is out here unboxing the dyson first <laughs> My mom was like showing my auntie and uncle the Dyson too because they're all just really excited about it. He's like, it is so worth it. And so I was like, okay, I need to get in and try it out. It's really small. Yeah. No, it's, it's so compact, but you can tell it works very intensely. Ah! <laughs> and it's cordless. Cut some of your hair, really. Oh, really? Oh, wow, that was fast. Yeah. How do you see it? <laughs> oh wow! Ethan's demonstrator. Woohoo! Hi, Daddy. Hi, okay. And then I also got this cool storage cart that Ethan's gonna assemble right now. I recently discovered that Ethan loves to open stuff. And I always get new packages in the mail. So this is match made in heaven. It's almost like me. He's Bob the Builder. I got this little rolling tray so I can move this outside if I need to. But I can also just make my coffee literally right here. Oh, oh no. Oopsies. Okay, we're all good now. So tonight I'm just gonna be doing some studying, some extra credit work hour, try to put away everything. I got so much new stuff today. I opened up a lot of fun Bed Bath & Beyond appliances today. Like just everything I featured in this video is gonna be linked down below. So just go click the links, get what you want, make your home your happy place. Cause like having all of this just makes my heart happy. I feel like I can focus better. Bed Bath & Beyond literally has everything you need I shop from there all the time even when I'm not doing videos with them so you already know if you guys want to keep up with me you can follow my Instagram right here also working on posting more colorful stuff for the summer I will see you guys in my next video in the meantime stay safe drink lots of water and tell your loved ones that you love them bye and if you're still in school best wishes to all of you you got this okay